The Oppo Find X7 Ultra features some faux leather and a really big camera bump. Oppo's newest flagship is the Find X7 Ultra. This phone's claim to fame is having two periscope camera lenses on the back. Like most Oppo phones, this will land in China first, probably Europe later, and won't come to the US. The X7 Ultra is all about photography, with 450MP sensors on the back. Periscope camera number one is a 50MP 3X telephoto that uses a 1-slash 1.56-inch Sony IMX890 sensor. Oppo says this sensor is roughly three times larger than the equivalent cameras in key competitor systems, and is the biggest telephoto sensor in any smartphone. Periscope number two is a 6X telephoto with a 50MP 1-slash 2.51-inch Sony IMX858 sensor, so more zoom, but less image quality. The main camera is Sony's top-of-the-line LYT901 inch sensor, and the wide angle is a 50MP Sony LYT600 sensor. Packing all these large cameras onto the back results in a big camera bump. Despite the phone being a normal-sized 6.8-inch device, the camera takes up about a third of the back, and it almost looks like you'll be touching it when you're naturally holding the phone. The back of the phone has an interesting two-tone design with a glass top and some kind of, presumably faux, leather covering the bottom half. The black version even features decorative stitching, which looks sharp. The display is a 120 Hz, 6.82 inch, 3168 by 1440 OLED. Google and Samsung are dumping the long-standing trend of making the displays curved along the long edges, but the Find X7 Ultra still seems to have a curved screen. Other specs include a Snapdragon HN3 associate, 12GB of RAM, 256GB of storage, and a 5000 mAh battery. Oppo's proprietary SuperVilsi wired charging hits 100W, while wireless, also proprietary, goes to 50W. The phone starts at 5,999 yuan in China, about $845, and ships on January 12. In March, Oppo was promising a special edition with satellite connectivity.